Hey guys, it looks a little crazy right here, but we are going to do another food pantry haul video. And I just opened a really cute letter from my advisor saying, Haley, happy spring break. I hope you've had time to rest. You've been doing such a great job this semester and I'm so proud of you. That is like the sweetest thing ever. Oh, that is such a great thing to like read and open up this whole video with. So let's get started. I guess I'm gonna start with this crazy pile right here. We have cereal, we have some Cheerios, and then we also have Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So it's some great cereal. I'm gonna put everything away eventually, just probably not right now. Just gonna do my best with all the cold items. This has a lot of knickknacks in here, guys. Like, okay, they stuff it full. We have some creamy butter mashed potatoes. We have chicken salad and white chicken. We have some ketchup packets. Like I said in the previous video, these are really great for some snacks or great with kids. You can just open it up and let them dip in there. Ah! We have a top ramen chicken. My daughter loves noodles. These are very interesting, something I've never seen before. It says, Takeaway Hunger and International Food Relief Campaign. It's fortified black beans and rice casserole. Ooh, that's so nice. And we got two of those. It says, I'm happy to stick to six and cups of water, water, stir, cover, boiling over low heat for 20 minutes, and occasionally add more water if needed, simmer for five minutes until rice is tender, change each flavor and calories, add oil, or any other favorite seasonings. That is so cool. That's awesome. I've never seen something like that before in these videos, so I love a new item. Tuna! I love tuna uh, we love tuna here we like to make make like craft mac and cheese or a mac and cheese box mac and cheese and put in a cup a can per box of uh, tuna making a tuna mac is what we call it i'm sure lots of people do that tomato sauce we have chicken noodle soup we have diced tomatoes cream of mushroom tomato and some black beans. All great pantry staples, good for making meals, good for just a lunch, for soup. Yeah, I love it. Let's get those out of the way. And the last two things in this box are some split green peas. I've already talked about how much we have so many of those. And we got lentils this time. I'm a little happy about that. That'll be a nice change. Let me know down below. I love your guys' comments. If there's anything you see or think that you know a recipe for, comment down below your recipes. We love reading them and we might even use them, especially even for a YouTube video. So let us know. I also have some more cans here, so let's just go through these quickly. Um, mini beef ravioli, those are great for lunches. SpaghettiOs, spaghetti, or not SpaghettiOs, but the spaghetti version. We have some carrots, we have green beans, we have corn, more corn, more green beans. We have some peas, peas, we have Ooh, peach slices. Lily's gonna love peach slices. Some applesauce and cranberry, jelloed cranberry sauce. I say this probably every week, but somebody please come organize my pantries uh, and everything in the house. Um, when I have more free time or downtime, I love organizing and cleaning. So if that ever gets uploaded to the channel, you're welcome. <laughs> but I am so busy with nursing school I literally go to school, go to work, work on homework, take care of my kid. We make dinner, we try to clean up, and not everything gets done. And so the house is always a little bit messy or the dishes are always not always done on, you know, every day or every time that we want them to be done, but that's life. So let that, that that's just the normal for those busy families. The hardest thing for us as a family is actually having meals ready to go at dinner time. I feel like we always get there and we're like, oh, we're so tired, we don't even wanna cook. So I really should probably think about if I have more time in the weekends, maybe some meal prepping. Uh, we'll see, I don't know, I'm busy. Like I always say, I say, I'm busy. And so, you know, my daughter's favorite new saying is, I'm busy. 
Mommy, I'm busy. All right, let's go through. Oh, there's that mac and cheese I was talking about. Great for some tuna mac. More mac and cheese. Ooh, I see some snacks. Okay, so we got some spaghetti noodles, lasagna noodles. Got all our pastas in here. Then we got some granola bars. We got the Nature Valley Crunchy Oats and Honey granola bars. I actually love these, and I used to spread peanut butter on these, get a little extra protein. With a cup of coffee or a tea to just dip your, I like to dip your little stuff in. I don't like to always dip cookies and stuff, but these, like granola bars, something so dried like this, I don't know why, but I like it. As long as I don't have too many little, little oats and stuff in my coffee or whatever, we're good. Velveeta Blueberry Crunch, yum. Reese's Coffee Cake Mix, O-M-G. Coffee cake already is phenomenal, but Reese's? We'll see. We have a whole pack of Hershey's here. I don't even need to go get chocolate. <laughs> That's wonderful. We have some croissants, three croissants. We have, I think these are hot dog. These are huge hot dog buns. Um, and they're huge. They're so, like, they're longer than, like, your normal grocery. These are, like, a, a bakery from an actual store. And then we got some hot dog buns. I think these ones are, like, the onion onion hamburger buns. Some nice bread. What is this one? Rye bread. Oh, so much bread. It looks like there's three peanut butter cookies. And we have a sack of potatoes. I have two more boxes. This is crazy. Strawberries are huge, guys. Like huge massive wow my daughter loves strawberries that is a win we have a mediterranean crunch chopped kit salad it's a sweet kale chopped kit it's nice a whole nother strawberries in here guys a whole nother win i think i'm gonna cut these up and freeze them because that's just the best way to feed it to my toddler and so then i don't waste food parsnips the holy grail of grilling Oh my goodness, if you guys do not know, like this is the best root ever. It's like a little sweet. We like to cut it up, put it in some foil oil and some garlic. Beautiful. We cut it like kind of like you're chopping carrots for a soup or something. It's the thinner the slice, sometimes it get a little crispy. Oh, we have some green onion. One more box here. Some Doritos. That's wonderful because my daughter, every time we go to buy chips for her, she gets over it or she's, it's, she's done. Like she'll favor pickle chips, dill pickle chips, then she's over it. She doesn't want them. Then she just wants classic chips. That's it. Then she'll only want the barbecue chips. And it's like, what chip do you want? Which one? And we portion them out. But you know what I'm saying? Like total win, you guys. The bag, it looks like there's something green. Some lettuce. I don't know how good it is, but we have some lettuce. Might have to just chop it up and see, kind of take off any bad pieces. We have a honey bun here. We have, that I know of, three of these Lunchables that we got that last time. The ham and cheddar and with the crackers. My daughter and my husband really loved those. We have ding dong, some little snackies. Ooh. We have vitamin D fat-free milk. That's insane. I've never seen milk in a bag. I do know in Canada, you guys have milk in a bag. That's crazy. Carefully put that away here soon. We also have rice milk. It says the perfect plant milk. I've never seen rice milk. I've seen oat, I've seen almond, but I've never seen rice. And you know what? My favorite thing to get at a Mexican restaurant is horchata, but not the alcohol version. I'm talking like literal like sugar rice water. It's so good. So I might love that. Put it in some coffee. Then we got some Capri Suns. That'll be great for Lily. Ooh, got more of the Sunny D's. This is the Tangy Original. So it's kind of like, you can see, it's not just orange, it's got like li li lemon, lime, and grapefruit. This is interesting. It's pretzels and then it's got salt and cheese packet or honey mustard or something that's frozen. So, and I have no instructions on how to cook that, but I'm guessing in the microwave. I don't really, or the oven. Right. Chicken party wings. It says first and second sections. It's all frozen, so that'll be a Zach thing. Something nice for the grill. Ground pork. 
I love this uh, grilled chicken breast strips. Anything that comes in these, it's like instant and ready to go. So great for meal time when you're like, oh, what do I want to make? These are so nice. You just pop it in the microwave usually and it's ready to go. Last time I think I got like rotisserie chicken and it was just as good. And last but not least, our pork tenderloin. So yeah, that was our food pantry haul. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Like, comment down below, subscribe, and join us in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.